Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. On the menu today, and as you can see right here, just finished this really simple and beautiful fish fry, Indian style. So it's got some lovely, lovely spicy flavors going on in there. We're gonna make a little paste for it and put it on. You can use any fish that you want from mackerel, swordfish, cod, anything works actually really really easy let's go and do it okay so let's get started now this works on any fish so you could use like a fish steak which is kind of what we're using today or of any type of fish swordfish moonfish kingfish or you can use it on mackerel tilapia like a whole fish no problem what we're doing here is we're going to make a fish paste or a curry paste to go onto our fish let me just look at what we've got here so Lemon juice, here I've got garlic ginger paste, which is a 50-50 mix of garlic and ginger. I've got about two hefty teaspoons there. And then about a teaspoon of turmeric, chili powder, coriander powder, salt and black pepper. I got two teaspoon each. Then I've got some oil. I'm just using a sunflower oil today. You can use any oil you like, canola or corn. Some chopped fresh green chili and here I've got some cilantro or coriander we're simply going to get this in a bowl give it a little mix and create a nice paste for our fish okay let's go just got a little bowl here with some lemon juice and that oil black pepper that one teaspoon Salt, one teaspoon. Turmeric, one teaspoon. Coriander, one teaspoon. Chili powder, one teaspoon. Then those fresh chilies. That cilantro or coriander. And then our garlic ginger paste. Now you can play around with this. You might want to add a bit more lemon or a little bit more chili or whatever you like but this is kind of roughly a, a nice mix i like this anyway so simply let's get this together that's looking fantastic that's a really lovely little marination for our fish okay let's move on So here's my fish. This is called a moonfish, a little bit like a swordfish maybe. You know, it's kind of fairly kind of robust kind of piece of fish. But like I say, you can use anything you want. Simply, let's get our marination and drop some on there. Just rub this around. Best way to do it is actually with your hand, which I'll do just momentarily. Let's flip them over. You can do this with sardines, mackerel, cod, tuna. There we go. So there we go, that was, we've used all that up there. Just a little marination. So just get it on there, on the top, round the sides, everywhere. Now what we want to do is we want to leave this, uh, put it in the refrigerator for about 20 to 30 minutes. You don't need to sort of do this overnight or anything like that. Um, and then it's going to be beautiful. What I am going to do, which a lot of people do not do, I mean some people just fry that exactly like that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to come back and give that a little bit of a rice flour or corn flour or cornstarch dip and it keeps all of the pieces on if i fry that now the chili will come off the coriander burns and comes off so i like to give it a little dust and then we're fried so fridge about 20 minutes be back then okay so i've got my flour here you can use a wheat flour all-purpose flour if you want i'm using rice flour today so we're simply going to just take our 
marinate some fish and just coat it. Nice little dusting. Perfect. I'm just going to repeat that process. Then we're ready to fry. Okay, so you need a flat skillet or frying pan. I'm just going to give this a little spray only with some oil. Nothing excessive. Just because we've got oil in our fish, don't remember when we made the marination. We're simply going to get that on. I've got the heat on, so it's going to start to heat through. Now, this is quite thick, this fish, so I don't want to go absolutely crazy, otherwise it will just burn on the outside and not cook in the centre. So I'm going to flip that over every sort of two to three minutes. This is probably going to take about, I don't know, seven or eight minutes in total. I'll come back when I'm flipping it over. That's looking wonderful to me. I mean, still a long way to go. I'm going to flip them a few more times. And if it gets a little bit dry, you can give it another little spray. Well, you don't have to use a spray. I'm just using the spray oil. Just add a little touch more oil if you want. Get it nice and golden brown. So I'm going to be flipping it a few more times. Okay. I'm really happy with this. Depending on what fish that you use, it depends on how long it cooks for. I like this to kind of let, some people put it in quite a lot of oil, I don't like to do that, more of a kind of dry fry in a way, touch of oil. I'm just going to serve that now with some lemon, it's going to be absolutely delicious. Off goes the heat. Okay, there we go. Really, really beautiful. So simple. Add and mix, you know, the spices as you wish. You might want to add a little bit of garam masala or something like that. I love that. So, so delicious. Hope you enjoy that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you soon. Lots of love.